Dietrich here from Fitness Quest Center. I've got your hockey tip of the week. Today we're working on acceleration. Acceleration, getting up to top speed as quick as you can. I got my man, Jeff Bristol, in the house today. Here we go, we're working on wall sprints, okay? So I'm gonna have Jeff come up to the wall. He's gonna come up onto his toes. He's gonna fall into the wall with his hands right in front of his chest. From there, I'm gonna instruct him to bring up his right knee and his right toe. Knees flex, toes flex, okay? Now we're gonna march from there. Go ahead, switch your feet, Jeff. You're gonna switch just like that. What I'm looking for is his lower back staying nice and flat. He's got a straight line from ear to ankle. Okay, so the next cue is reactive component. I'm gonna say switch, and he's gonna jump his feet in and out of place. Ready, switch, good, switch, switch, and relax, good. Okay, the last one is a reactive cue with a number. So I'm gonna say one, three, or five, and that's the number of times he's gonna switch his feet. All right, right knee up, right toe up. Go ahead, one, three, and five. Good, and relax. That's perfect. That's good, Jeff. Gonna stand it on up. So you notice how his knee's up the whole entire way. That's for full stride length. And you need to get full stride, stride length. If your knee's not come up the whole way, you're not gonna cover as much ground. This is an important uh, exercise for all hockey players because you're skating all the time. You need to make sure you maintain general athleticism through exercises just like this, and you'll get much faster on the ice in return. So thanks for checking out my video, and I'll see you next time.